How do we represent data in a computer? All data inside of modern computers are stored as a series of ones and zeros. We call this binary data. The ones and zeros are called binary digits, or bits for short. In modern computers, data are stored in small blocks of eight bits called a byte. We can combine two, four, eight, or more bytes together to create larger blocks of binary data. However, the computer needs to understand what each of these blocks of ones and zeros represent. Is it a word, a number, a date and time, or something else? This is where data types come into play, not to be confused with the types of data we discussed previously. A data type is an attribute of data that tells the computer what a group of binary data represents. They tell the computer how to interpret the bits of data, either as a character, a number, a date, or something else. They determine what operations can be performed on the data, like addition, subtraction, and multiplication. They specify how the data are stored and the size of the data by the number of bytes they require. And they instruct the computer on how to display the data in a human-readable format. For example, we represent the letter A as a byte of binary digits using a sequence containing a 0, a 1, 5 zeros, and a 1. We represent the digit 1 in binary as two zeros, two ones, three zeros, and a 1. And we represent the percent symbol as two zeros, a 1, two more zeros, a 1, a 0, and a 1. Essentially, we can represent anything that can be typed into a computer as a sequence of ones and zeros using data types. To learn more, please click the link in the description. For more content like this, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe.